G'day guys, Ryan here. Today I wanted to talk about why I start all of my thoughts about social media content that I want to create and share. Why I start with Instagram in mind first. And so, you know, you might think that's a bit strange that, you know, well, are you thinking about Instagram before you post on Twitter? Are you thinking about Instagram before you post on Facebook or LinkedIn? Yes and yes and even Snapchat. So the reason I start with Instagram first is because it's such a great platform for making you think creatively to tell your story or to communicate a key message or a key piece of information. You get your opportunity to share a photo or a 10 photo gallery, carousel photos, up to one minute of video and a caption. And that really makes you think, what are you going to say? Why would people care about it? And how can you deliver it in a way that captures people's attention as they scroll through their phone in a busy day? The other reason I get people to think about Instagram first is because if you're creating a great piece of content for Instagram, it can easily then be shared across to Facebook, or at least you can absolutely modify it, but share that sort of content does really well on Facebook as well. I think the same about Twitter too. Taking your tweets to the next level by in including the graphic that you've created on Instagram natively, maybe even the video, uh, can help it gain traction and engagement. So that's really important. And the same with LinkedIn. Now I know you know sometimes that uh, you can get more traction traction from just text updates on LinkedIn and even tweets as well. But I think telling the story visually is a great place to start. It becomes an image or a short video or a bunch of images that you can share in the blog posts, embed them into other content. You get the option with Instagram now, of course, to play around with stories, add the emojis, add you know the different layers of uh, filters and graphics and imagery and even draw on them. You can be really creative and I think that's why I like to get people to think about that first. Take your story and sum it up in a really engaging image and caption on Instagram and you'll be set with being able to condense it into a tweet, being able to condense it into a short, sharp Facebook post or LinkedIn post, and you'll have some success because thinking with Instagram in mind first, whenever you're starting to post, will keep you on track with making sure you're putting out super content. So thanks very much.